Okay, everybody, welcome to today's video, and this is going to be a quick update video. Just basically saying, release about basically talking over the release of the new box update 8 1.3.2. Here he is. Here, uh, it was released yesterday, a bit of on the 11th, which was what the, the top right yesterday. Uh, that's basically it was basically a bit of an unexpected update, to be honest. It was because a guy on the forum, which I'll show you guys here, had uh, basically he made an icon pack, it's called the Ions Pack. I did make a video here. Just by icons, take you how to install it. Um, that's kind of a bit irrelevant now because basically this has been um, fixed. If we go somewhere, I think it was block extensions and then ion icons. Uh, so this guy basically here, stay over. He basically made the icons, uh, they converted it to you could download it here, then install it. Um, and basically, the, he recoded all the icons in there to basically make them work with the blocks. But then, when they exported, they weren't exported properly. And so, this update was—it was a tiny little update, just basically addressing this issue. So you could basically use this and other ones that Norm had added and coded in blocks. So you can see, here you go. As you can see, it's a little credit to him here for making the icons set. So we're just going to add an icon into blocks now. And then I'm going to demonstrate the new changes. So this is all normal here. They open up the menu. Bang. Look at that. You, you started to fall awesome before. And now you've got ion ions, feather icons, ET icons. Not many, many in these. But I'm sure there'll be a few more added in the near future. Uh, but yeah, you also see there's a few minor UI changes. Now the icons look a lot clearer than what they were before. They're a lot bigger. You can now uh, you can search these. Some of the tags aren't exactly on the best. But most of them are pretty good. Most of them are pretty accurate. Uh, which is pretty always pretty fun. Oh, as it's free to have, there we go. Uh, seems to have froze for a bit there. No idea what this one is. Choose this one and also go over to the left as well. It's a bit weird, but I'm sure it's not really a problem. They seem to work quite well anyway. Uh, as you can see, all the effects, most of the effects work with them, and of course, all the colors work with them as well. They go white, that didn't really work very well. Let's do a red one. They all the colors work with them as well, and then of course, you can make this. Center, right, left. There you go in the center. Um, they're all pretty cool. Some of these, uh, this some of these icons. We'll take a look at a few others uh, as we got the time to. Let's go on feather icons. Look, we've got some bow. We got a paste, a lock, button. Got a attachment kind of icon up there. Uh, got a database one, computer screen, camera, FaceTime kind of one. That's quite a few. There's a full screen one. There's a tick. There's a cross. Yeah, there's a, there's a few decent icons in that Ion icon. Ion icon. I oh. <laughs> Ion icons, icons are pretty good. There's a load in here. You can see he, they're all well tagged as well because that's the way they've been uh, programmed to be tagged. As you see, there's a camera on here. You got two of each. Most of them, one of these, and pressed one. The others, the non-pressed one. So we've got football. We've got pressed football and a non-pressed football. Uh, as you can see, that looks pretty cool as well. If we go on to centers, that looks pretty cool. Good depth in that in that icon as well. There's quite a few decent ones. Uh, basically, this is all part of the 1.8 point 1.3.2 update. As you see, I've added all the ones. You can also add your own icons. If basically you've made the icons, you can then go Dev Tools. You can then compile your extension, and that allow you to compile your compile the icon pack that you've just made. If that makes sense. If you have made an icon pack, if you want to uh, embed that yourself, it's also pretty cool. Uh, now, also another little change is on the extension. Okay, so after quick time bugged out on me back again. Anyway, um, so you see on my wall, I've got all of there. There are the border A's and black border stars here, which I have got at the bottom. I think the image ones, no blocks or, or, uh, or the extension things installed yet. Nobody's actually made any, which is surprising. I thought it'd be a uh, jumped on quite quickly, but see, the only thing on the uh, on these block extension is uh, stay Uber's thing that he's made. Um, nothing really else on here. Uh, be sure to check out my videos in the next few days. I've got a Google Analytics one I do believe here that's coming basically shows you how to make Google Analytics work with blocks uh, Quite useful tutorial quite good and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. -bye.